What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks. And today we're going to check out a cool new exposed module that lets you add functionality to your on-screen navigation bar. One of the best things about having a phone with on-screen buttons is that they don't have to always remain exactly the same. Root mods of all kinds will let you do things like changing the buttons themselves, or even just their double tap and long press functionality. Well, developer F. Barroso Apps has taken that customization a step further with the help of Exposed. And if you're not rooted or you don't have the Exposed framework installed, don't worry. I've got a step-by-step -step walkthrough on this with links to root and Exposed guides. It's just waiting for you at the link below this video, so pop on over there and have a look. F. Barroso has made their Exposed module available through the Play Store, so all you have to do to get it installed is search Extended Nav Bar. And when you've got it installed, you'll see a notification from the Exposed installer that tells you the module isn't activated yet. So just tap Activate and Reboot on this one, and when you're back up, we'll check out all the new functionality. Okay, so now that the module is activated and you've rebooted, you already have the default functionality going. Just swipe in from one edge of the nav bar and you'll see some of the extra options it's added. Keep in mind that the swipe gesture used here only works when you start the swipe from one of the edges. By default, there's a set of new buttons on either side of the original Back Home Recents buttons. But if you go into the app, there's a few more customization options. You can set what buttons you want to show on either side. There's the music player controls, quick settings, and if you donate $2, you can even add a set of up to six apps as one of your navigation bar pages. After you make any changes, a toast message lets you know that a reboot is needed before these changes come into effect. And there's even a handy button right in the module's interface that lets you do that. It's a brand new module, so I have hopes that even more features will eventually be added. But I like this thing so much that I've already donated. Not that I even wanted the quick apps, but it's quality work, and I wanted to show my appreciation. But yeah, for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over at the link below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, guys. But until then, keep hacking those gadgets.